Hello everyone, I'm Caterina Rocchi, principal of Luca Manga School in Italy. This time I will introduce some important points when creating manga for print. There are things you need to be aware of when you draw manga for printing, for example crop marks and the basic expression color of a document. Let's have a look at that together. This time I'm creating a monochrome manga for print in Clip Studio Paint Pro. Refer to this tutorial to avoid any problems when making your own. Let's start off with how manga pages are set up. The large rectangle in the middle of the page is called the standard border. If speech bubbles or drawings are near these edges of the page, they may end up being cropped or hidden in the binding process. The standard border is meant to prevent that. As a basic principle, the panel layout should be based off of this border. By placing important dialog and graphics inside of the standard border, the pages will be easy to read when printed. The rectangle lines surrounding the standard border are part of the crop border. Next to that is the bleed border as an extension. This indicates the finished size of the manuscript. Everything beyond the crop border will be cut after printing, so I'm sure you can imagine what happens to any drawings and lines there. Make sure to keep this in mind so that nothing important is lost in the end. On the other hand, when paper is printed, millimeter thick misprints can appear on each page of the bound book due to how the paper is cut. So, if you only draw up to the inner border, unwanted slivers of white might be visible near the edges. In order to prevent this, when putting an image right at the edge of the manuscript, make sure it extends past the bleed border and past the crop border shown in red on the screen. You can choose the settings for the default border and crop border when creating a new page file via New File. I would like to explain some more points to consider when creating a new manuscript file. If you are creating a document for print, it's useful to set the size unit to millimeters. When making a new file, you can choose a binding size from the presets or input the size yourself. However, the size that you are choosing here is the binding size, not the canvas size. When you create a new canvas, you can see that the canvas size is larger than the binding size. Next, when making a new manuscript, the default expression color can be set to monochrome, grey or color. If you intend to print the comic in black and white, you should set the basic expression color to monochrome from the start. If a document is created in grayscale but the print data is meant to be monochrome, the drawing on the canvas will look different to the actual print output. To change these settings after you have already created the manuscript, open the Edit menu and go to Canvas Properties. Now, let me share some tips for sending your work to print shops. When creating a manga manuscript with multiple pages, make sure to put the pages numbers, also called folio, onto the canvas so that the print shop can understand easily. Also, when you save each page file with Clip Studio Paint Pro, I recommend that you put the page number in each file name.
Lastly, I will explain how to avoid the moire interference effect when creating and exporting a manuscript. The moire effect is the unintentional creation of a pattern and this often occurs when overlaying different patterns or tones. If you unintentionally create a moire effect, the final manuscript may look very different to your intended manuscript. In the creation of a manga manuscript, moire can occur when multiple tones overlap. By adjusting the line frequency and angles of overlapping tones, it is possible to prevent this effect. However, if you stack tones, you will need to shift the pattern slightly so that this is reflected properly when printing. To do this, use the Move Tone Pattern tool. Are you ready to start drawing? There are more videos where I introduce drawing illustrations, color manga and useful functions for beginners. Please have a look!